Oh, I see us. I think we're... Hello. Yeah, I think I think we'll be all right as long as we don't die to Rufio. <laughs> I'm ready. Oh no! I'd like to go. <laughs> Wouldn't get me out of the menu. Here we go. Nobody can hear you? Nobody can hear you? Just checking real quick. No Kong audio. Oh, oh I think my audio wasn't coming through your screen. But we're going to swap oh, it over. Not. Do you want to reset and start again or you're just going to keep going? Uh, we can reset. Alright, let's do it real quick. So yeah, let me know when I am here, and I will uh, redo the little, uh, what I was talking about at the beginning. I think I'm there. I think CVG's good. Right. Oh, yep, yeah, I'm here. So, right. welcome stuff. out. We got some hook going on, and we got some hook facts for you. Every one of your $5 donations is good for one hook fact. If you would like to give me your own hook fact to read, donate them $5. That also gets you entered into to the raffles and everything we got at the uh, end of the marathon coming up here. We got perlers, merch, all that good stuff. But yeah, we're going to get this race started real quick here, and I'll tell you all more about that charity here uh, just a little bit. So, uh, are you all set to go? I am ready, yeah. All right, let's do three, two, one, go. Oh, oh. Cool menu. One, one cool thing about this game is you get, like, five seconds to start on the start screen. <laughs> <laughs> and when you miss, you miss. But it's all good. Anything can happen in this race. Yeah, it's been a while since I've played any hook, so I'm hoping it'll uh, work out. It worked out not too poorly. Uh, what am I doing right? Now? Not too poorly. The last marathon I did it in. I can't remember what marathon I was. All right, no dying to Rufio. I don't know if you do it, but I take intentional damage on him, and it kind of times uh, when I want to hit him next. Oh, yeah, Rufio, right? Yeah. Yeah. I saw that in uh, one of the videos, and I was like, oh, that's a, that's a good thing. I like that. And it helps, you know, if you're going for a good time... Um, you lose frames by how much health and how much uh, flyability you have as it counts down. So, taking as much damage as possible before the end of the level will save you a few frames. 
have my inputs eaten in the forest here right at the start of the uh like jumpy section i got so scared <laughs> i hate when that happens Sometimes in that like last half of the forest section there with all the sprites on screen and whatnot, you can you can get your jump inputs eaten. It's or your or your sword inputs. Yeah. Yeah, it's it can be rough. Boss fight didn't give me any of the uh spot where I can't hit him, so that was nice. Nice. I got good RNG also. Some of the bosses in this game have some pretty rough RNG. the archer guy right oops I messed that up it's a nice little clip when you're climbing the mountain yeah I missed that clip I had to fight the uh, archer guy oh we got $5 towards Super Ghouls and Ghosts bonus game from Jason saying, Hook fact, Robert De Niro was originally cast for the role of Hook in the movie, but he quit when he learned he couldn't actually stab anyone. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, Hook fact. You heard it here first, folks. <laughs> and we have another one that says, Give me a Hook fact. So yeah, let me, let me give you all a little Hook fact. Uh... I looked one up before, and I'll remember it soon. I'll give you a hook fact that uh, I learned just before this race. Nice. That this game is not actually a Disney game. <laughs> <laughs> I was very disappointed to learn that. I did die to uh, Rufio during uh, right before the stream started, so that's a good hook fact if you're trying to play uh, hook is not to die to Rufio. Tell you what, though, this mermaid when you're in the water is very annoying. Ugh. It saved me for a second. I felt like something was on my forehead, and I reached up, and I went to the bottom of the water, and almost, <laughs> almost went underneath <laughs> the screen. And this is one of those bosses that has RNG. Ugh. They just didn't want to help me out at all. Oh, I got him. Nice. <coughs> oh. Uh oh, I think Ant did this one. This is the donation from Patty. Five dollars towards the Simpson uh, character bid war for Bart. It said hook fact: Patio Ferguson discount patio furniture furniture store. Has all the best prices on hoses. Oh, I was supposed to swing my sword there. Whoops. What a wonderful hook pack. That's a good one. That's better than Don't Die to Rufio. Whoops. Now, I don't remember this cave in the movie. Ah, the only thing I remember from the movie is that nasty food fight scene. Yeah, with the starving children. <laughs> the ones that were trying to help to, the, today. When you watch that movie as a kid, you're like, oh, how fun, they're having a food fight. But when you watch it as an adult, you're like, man, these kids are imagining that they actually have food because they're Poor and homeless and starving. 
I never thought about that, dude. I just thought it always grossed me out. <laughs> oh boy. I thought I uh, jumped oh, oh, too early. Uh oh. Get up, get up. Oh no, we're gonna die. Uh oh. Oh man, I got hit by. For whatever reason, I got hit by the the tigers on the ice level. Oh, right after getting the uh, health upgrade? Yeah. Yeah, I thought I was gonna get there too. I, uh, I clipped. So, uh, Pan will clip into a, like a platform if his pixels are like above his waist. And uh, I clipped onto the ramp, and then I got hit by the tiger. And then I got stuck in the spikes like a frozen loop. Uh, yo, fell through the floor. I got the good fight on the boss. Oh, nice. I can't remember, yeah, is this I'm the sure. auto-scroller next? Short on health, so I'm not gonna try this floor skip. The floor skip saves a lot of time if you can get it. Well, I got a little auto scroller going on. I know we uh, all joking with the hook facts, having a good time, and uh, but yo, thank y'all so much. Y'all, y'all's donations mean so much, helping us, uh, helping us this weekend, trying to support this charity. So I just want to say, like, thank you all so much. You know, the hook facts, a little joke. Thank you all for indulging with me and for donating to uh, to this cause. Absolutely. Almost forgot how to fly. <laughs> it was a little scary. <laughs> Just the easiest level in the game. One of the things I love most about this game is uh, just pans animations. Yeah. Everything is so heroic with him. Like, the way he struts, the way he jumps. I don't remember wa Robin Williams looking like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's the only game you play as Robin Williams. Um, How much does it count? Like, don't you get, like, a genie summon in Kingdom Hearts? Does that... Or is that not, like, a main character? I forgot where to go in the cave. You're saying there's a chance. Yo, what's up, Mora? Fortunately, you don't get to play as the genie in Aladdin, though. Somebody made a Good Morning Vietnam homebrew. That game you can play. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm hitting all the spikes. Oh, oh no, don't die, Kong. Oh, I don't have the pan sword. Where the hell am I going? I always seem to get hit by at least one set of spikes on the way down. Cross our fingers. Yep, there it is. <laughs> Use too much fly meter?
Wait, I don't really, I don't know. <laughs> Is there really a Good Morning Vietnam homebrew game? I don't know why that was the only movie I could think of that Robin Williams nope. was. Oh, are you kidding me? How? Oh, gosh. I don't even know where that puts me. Wait, did I say... That's unfortunate. Yes, sir. Oh man. Well, that just ruined this level. Oh no. There's the part at the very end with the frogs and the spiders. Yeah. And I dropped down there and uh, we were talking about eating inputs. <laughs> and it ate my sword input and then I got killed. Yo, that Maggie, thank you for that raid. Appreciate that. Oh, I got the run speed on the little platforms. Yeah, actually, a decent versus pirate state. been the worst run that I've had of all my practice. Oh no. Did this room right for the first time in forever. Which room? Uh, like that first room in the uh, like very last stage, jumping over the guy's head and landing so you can get the run speed before the next one. Oh yeah, that's tricky. I kept like forgetting that that part existed, so I'd always go too late and I wouldn't be able to make it. But I'm gonna remember this time. Shoot, you guys dropped the health for me. See if I can get some run on the platform here. Ooh, nice. I did it. That's like a pixel perfect situation to get run on those platforms. Oh, the little ones around the spikes? Yeah. I don't know why I'm dying so many times. <laughs> Excuse me. That's a good hook fact, Jason. The house was weird to me. <laughs> <laughs> Game reminds me of weed. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad, like ten and a half over PB, but that's not bad. All right. 
I'm inside the pirate ship, so we're almost there. Dad, you are Peter Pan. Hook fact. Thanks for the GGs, I appreciate that. That's Jack's hook fact. Hook fact, Dad, you are Peter Pan. Oh. Flying through spikes. This part's like, uh... When you're flying diagonally, you're, you're like hitbox, isn't it? Small as it looks. Yeah, he has pretty, I mean, in general, he has a pretty big hitbox. Alright, time for some hook. The worst part here is when you're running behind Thudbutt, you gotta swing your sword or you'll run too fast. You'll go past him and hit the enemies he's supposed to run over. <laughs> right. I always swing my sword on the way down. All right, final boss. Let's go. Six hits. Every three steps he takes. Yeah, that's how I. Yeah. <laughs> horrible run <laughs> but we got through it it's still a fun game even even when it doesn't go uh doesn't go Absolutely. super good it's still fun to play <laughs> yeah i definitely recommend people trying this game at least yeah once you get once you get past like learning how to run and like the momentum uh, it's actually, like, really fun. Yeah, I absolutely hated this game the first, like, three times I played it. And then I just... kept playing. <laughs> it just didn't stop. I, I hated it, but I was having fun at the same time. <laughs> but real quick, before we turn it over to, um... our next run, our next game, I just want to remind y'all, uh... why we're here, and to thank you all helping us out but we're here running our uh annual charity marathon here for random acts random acts is a 501c3 nonprofit committed to spreading kindness through programs such as the childhood hunger campaign or directly sorry i moved my sheet by building schools shelters and more providing support for thousands of children's families and individuals around the globe for more information visit randomfacts.org and like we were saying before with the hook facts, uh, every $5 donation gets you into little raffles that we're doing at the end of this marathon. We've got merch, like RGL shirts and whatnot. I've made a ton of perlers. we got some custom artwork that I've seen some of. Games and merch from Next Level Video Games. And yeah, every donation, $5 or more, gets you added in there. But yeah, I want to thank you all for uh, hanging out with us with some hook and, and for all the donations so far this weekend. Y'all have been awesome. We really appreciate it. Uh, yeah. Pony All ends up next. And after that, I'll be back up with some Super Star Wars trilogy. Nice. Yeah, I'll see you all tomorrow morning, maybe afternoonish. Got a little Last Ninja, a little Messenger. But yeah, thanks again for uh, everything you've done so far for us this marathon, and thanks for hanging out and having fun with Hook with us, and uh, we'll see you all later. <laughs>